Can kids learn to weld? Absolutely, definitely. I've had kids as young as nine years old welding with me, so maybe you'll be the youngest person I have welding in here today. here with professional metal sculptor Spacey, the owner of Iron Wood Studios. Nice to meet you. Thanks nice for coming. Too. How did you become a welder and sculptor? Uh, well, I originally went to art school to learn how to make jewelry and I got my hands on a welder and learned how to weld for the first time and I totally fell in love with it. And when I graduated from college, my parents bought, bought me my first welder, and I started welding, and I've been doing that ever since. I wanna weld one day. You're gonna weld today. <laughs> what kind of tools do you use for welding? Well, the main tool that I use is called a MIG welder, and that uses electricity instead of flames to, to weld with. And then we use um, our welding helmets, which are the very important part of welding that keeps your eyes protected. Um, we use hammers and measuring tapes and chop saws and angle grinders. There's all kinds of tools that we use here. Why do you have classes just for women? Well, I wanted to create a place where women felt comfortable to try something that was a little scary without the guys around. So um, everybody feels safe and okay with kind of making mistakes and we support each other and cheer each other on. No, no boys, boys allowed, no boys Dada. Allowed. <laughs> Do you have a favorite project you have worked on? I would say there was a sculpture that I made over the summer that was just recently installed up in Rochester in the Swilberg neighborhood, and it was a sculpture of a woman named Blanche Calloway. Why do you love what you do? Well, I have to say, a big part of it is that it's a different thing to do. Women don't usually weld, usually men do welding. So that feels kind of cool. And um, I love making things. And the thing that's fun about welding is it happens instantly. You can make two things stick together in just two seconds. And it creates sparks, and it's just a really exciting, fun thing to do. Do you have any cool classes planned for the future? Yes. Um, I am planning on having a class in April when the solar eclipse is going to happen because the cool thing with the welding helmets is you can look at the solar eclipse when that's happening. So I'm going to do a class where we make a sun and a moon and we can watch the eclipse when it happens. Before that, for the holidays, um, every weekend in November and December, we're going to be welding reindeer. Quick question, okay? Yeah. Books or movies? Books. Cats or dogs? Dogs. Welding or sculpture? Welding. Thank you so much to Stacy and make sure to check out Ironwood Studio. <laughs>